Daily struggles at the Freeman compound. <laughs> What's going on guys? How's it going? Mark Freeman 408. Welcome to the channel. The Mercedes is stuck. Going the wrong way. Uh, if you're new, if you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe and hit notifications. We post eight videos a week and we do a lot of crazy stuff with a lot of cars. So I just got a minivan, BMW, Cadillac, Buick, Mercedes, Sport Track, Subaru, and turbocharged PT Cruiser. So we are on a roll. Anyways, today we're gonna jump the minivan. I actually just got it two days ago, but the thing is on its last legs. It did a massive burnout. It wasn't sounding well. And minivans are hilarious to jump. So we're gonna open both doors. <laughs> Anyways, we gotta boost the minivan, so that's what, uh, Oh, I stalled it. Didn't like that. <laughs> Didn't like that? Uh, so yeah, what's up guys? How's it going? Make sure you leave some nice comments. If you guys have any suggestions for cars we need to jump, let us know. Because as you can see, my resources are pretty much unlimited for jumping cars. I'm getting ready for a big demo. <laughs> I'm getting ready for a big demolition derby. That's why I'm stocking up. But then uh, these cars will be going to the scrapyard. So I own five of them and then the Buick, the Cadillac, and the Sport Track, the Scrapyard zones them, but I own all these ones, so. Whew! Yeah, that's a lot of talking. Anyways, let's get this thing started. Then we're gonna launch her off the jump. Our last record jumped here. Well, the Durango hit there, and then the Escape went boom, hit the top, and then bounced over and actually landed down there. So we've never had one go all the way over. We've never had one clear this. We've had the escape it bounced over, but one day I want to see one clear this. What are you trying to do? I have no clue. Anyways, we'll get this thing boosted and then we'll uh, launch her off the cliff. So it turns out the battery's on that side and the that battery's on that side. So we got to come up this side of the jump and then, and then probably end up nailing the front end of this thing this thing is so nice supercharged mercedes 300 bucks like what else do you need in life Let's see if we can ramp it over the end here we need to spray this track that's for sure we've barely ridden here though we've been so busy i know you guys have been loving the car stuff that's for sure the car stuff seems to get a ton of views i wish i could post 20 videos a week if i had a editor and like a full-time assistant i definitely could but it's definitely a lot of work it's not easy Slow down! <laughs> Maybe you should have sped up. <laughs> like, slow down. I know. Like, I, I don't know why I was saying slow down. I felt like you were just going to launch this. Ah, frick. Um, hold on. Before you dig a hole, let me jump in the back. Give me a little push here. I should probably do it with the back of the Buick. Yeah, I'll do it with the back. Just full struggle city. My freaking trunk popped open. <laughs> uh oh. It's stuck in park because it's on the incline. Oh. Never ending struggle. He's stuck in park now. Come on. This thing keeps going into limp mode. We got the minivan going. Justin, give her a little pump of gas there. She is freaking loud. Just a quick one. Oh, so loud. So the now the Mercedes is stuck on the hill. We left the hood open. It, it's like did some collision warning thing, so now it doesn't want to start, but whatever. We're going straight to the minivan, and then we're gonna wrap this day up. It is 6.48 time to jump and go at the pool or something so we're setting up the gopro she good to gopro she's good to gopro beauty now's your chance buddy now's your chance rise and shine <laughs> come on let's jump her temp number one
Wow. That didn't go very high, but it sure made a lot of noise. Oh my God. Dude, it's so muddy up there. <laughs> yeah, it looks pretty muddy. That thing, yeah, kind of gutless. <laughs> Sounds sweet. Did it? <laughs> it just took off spinning, so. Oh well, I wanted to do a car jump this week. It was it, time for it to go. Yeah, it is kind of, you know, really muddy, so. Did it at least get a little bit of air? Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, the airbag. Oh, frick, we forgot to take the airbags out. Oh. Oh, well. <sighs> well, they smashed the screen. Oh, it took the door off. Yeah, right off. Well, at least... I like how you closed it and it still went to open. I left it open. I just didn't have it open all the way. Oh. Well, you know what the issue is? It's because the Dodge... The Dodge and the Ford Escape did so well. Now it's just gonna be a struggle. Yeah, so, well, for this one at least. If you guys wanna check out the Ford Escape jump, check out the link below, I'll put it in there. It frickin' flew, it went over that side, so. Huh. Should we assess the damage? I'm like shaking, but I'm not that excited right now. I'm just like, yeah. Yeah, when but, you've seen it go over that mound, Yeah. how far is that? Um, I'd say probably, you know, 60, 70 feet just to the mound. Yeah. I think we measured it was like 75 to the bottom. But uh, yeah, this thing's still in good condition. Anyone want to buy some parts of it? <laughs> <laughs> I still love the sound it makes. Oh, Every time it, it makes a bang. It blew both doors off. Blew both doors off the <laughs> minivan. Blew the nuts right off it. That's hilarious. Well, that's some good damage, I would say. We should have surfed that. <laughs> It, uh, there was a big puddle at the bottom though, and it did nail the puddle. So. I did see that. It slowed down a yeah. lot when I hit that. Oh well, I, I wasn't really a really big fan of this minivan anyways, so I don't really care that it didn't go too far. You know, yeah. they can't all be good. Then no. they wouldn't be interesting. You know? Exactly. You got to have these these side jumps and yeah, these random jumps and. We'll have to get the skids there and clean this jump up a bit and get some of the water out. I sprinted down because I thought it was just gonna roll over and then take off either to my truck or the other cars. Imagine they hit that berm and just landed on the Ford. Oh. That'd be a bad day. It would not be fun. Uh, uh, well, we can take this thing back to the scrap yard. We took the cat off it, so at least we got that accomplished. Before it was covering water and mud. Yeah, I guess the passenger airbag didn't go off because there's no passenger. No. It's weird how these things have knee airbags in them. I've only seen yeah. them go off in minivans. I think. Launchomatic did its job. Not the original though. Uh, the, launch, the Launchomatic has, this new one has beat, I think the old one though. Really? Because it was that one for the Ford Escape, so. Oh yeah, true. We used to have a, a piece of plywood that was called the Launchomatic, but I think someone stole it because it's not here anymore, so. So weird. I know. Of all the things to steal. Odd. But yeah, if you guys have any suggestions for vehicles to jump, or if you have any vehicles you want to see jumped, let me know. We're in the London area, so I'll drive up to like an hour to come get it, but anything farther. Like I'm not driving up to Barrie or Muskoka to get a vehicle. There's tons around here, so I'm out of breath. Have we got uh, quite the collection going. I know. I can't wait to jump that PT Cruiser, actually. Yeah, and it sounds sweet, so. Yeah, yeah, now that we come. Mid-air, it's just going to be obnoxious. Uh, Especially with that turbocharger on it. I didn't know they put turbochargers on PT Cruisers. This is like the heaviest styrofoam. How do you feel that? Oh, wow. I think it's, it's like it's water yeah. or something. Oh, huh. Huck it in there. Anyways, I'm going to wrap this up for now. I got mud in my butt. Mud butt. Thank you guys for watching. As always, check out the links below. Uh, I'll put the Ford Escape video in the link below if you want to see it. It went. It went friggin' far. Biggest one yet. Biggest one yet. It wasn't the highest, but it was the farthest one. For sure. The Jeep uh, Cherokee was definitely the highest. I'm sure you guys saw that floating around Instagram and YouTube, but uh, that was our proudest one. So, yeah, make sure to leave some comments and uh, let us know about vehicles. Yeah. I'm always down to jump as many vehicles as I can a week. I live 10 minutes from the scrapyard, so we just take them there after. So. Anyways, thank you guys again. Make sure to subscribe, hit the notifications. And have a fantastic night. Go do something crazy. Yeah. Like leave a comment. Yeah. Don't jump a minivan though. It's stupid. Yeah. yeah. Leave that to me. <laughs> the Canadians. Canadians. Okay. Bye. Alright. See you guys later.